Sri Lanka in Mirissa, which is the southernmost point in Sri Lanka. I'm just here for a family vacation, so I don't even know if I'll be able to like full on vlog like a like I did for Bali. But maybe a few snippets of here and there. It's actually come vlog, pull out. So I'm here with my family. I don't think I'd be able to vlog every day and make a whole segment out of it like I did for Bali. And at the end of the day, this is a family vacation and I'm just going to enjoy most of it uh, with them. And it's kind of hard to vlog at every moment with my family. But I hope I get quite a few clips of it and I hope you somewhat enjoy this tiny, small, possible vlog. Okay, we're going we're going to the beach now. So to have the view of the beach from our hotel. It's right there. Uh it's hot. It's hot. day two and we just had brunch and we're going to the secret beach right now it's the most adventurous thing we've done as a family <laughs> with my brother we're in the hood -ta -ta -ta. okay ghetto Yeah. Yeah. It's called meta meta vlogging. Screenshot of Fialo, look at that. So we're out, we're freshen up, we're gonna go have some dinner. I suggested a place, but it seemed a little too continental, um, very cafe bistro types, and we want, I think, a little bit more of the beach side and more of a bit more of the beach side. What? So we want more of the beach side and local food. So we're gonna go to the beach side place. Oh, wait, wait, can you take some last line? Is that? 
Okay, it's step up on the stage. Okay, okay. It's sad songs. A few moments later. But I saw the whale and then I threw up. And I saw another whale and then I threw up. So 10 on 10 would recommend. It's not that bad. I'm just gonna go put some orange juice and have some water and maybe some breakfast. Thank you. 
couple and Matthew shot himself. Yeah, whatever. You wish I did. That's, that's how desperate you are for vlog material. It's yes. sand, bro. No, it's shit. Family vacation is just that we just wing it and we don't do something extra adventurous. It's more like we sort of just want to relax most of the times, which makes sense. And um, yeah, my family is a little worried that I will fall off the cliff. Which I won't be surprised. But okay. Um, so far, okay, that's the lighthouse. It's like famous <laughs> for this place. And I like the autos because they're all so colorful. No, it's not. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> A cashew tree. Oh. Education 101, Sharon. Like I took pictures but I forgot to vlog. <laughs> that is the lighthouse. Oh, we're going down to the beach. Okay, that's the. time to do assignments but I did tell myself that I'll be more organized this year and I'll get things done better like on time and yet here I am 
But it's just the first month, hopefully. I don't know why I'm on vacation. I don't know why I'm still here. I see a lot of people just going back from their vacation, already back in the Netherlands. And then I'm still here, having the time of my life. I just feel like I'm gonna pay for it this year. I don't know, that's that, that's something I told my parents too. Uh, that I feel like 2019 was such a good year. You know, it, it went so good. And I probably, or I hopefully have posted a video about this. I just want to know how 2020 works out. Because I have a feeling that, that it's not gonna be great. I don't know why. I, I just have this feeling. But this decade just might be. Like by the end of the decade, I feel like it'll be an amazing year and I look back on it and be like oh I grew so much and I learned so much but for this year I, I, I can't say the same thing it, everything is just so like not planned, not stable I don't know where I'm gonna be by the end of the year I don't know if I'll find a housing mid-year I don't know where I'm gonna travel I don't know if I'll be able to travel I don't know if I'll be able to finish my MA I, I just don't know like this it's just but yeah, I'm just really nervous, but I'm also very excited for 2020. And then I'm gonna go do my assignment plus okay. Then we're gonna go out for dinner. Why is it so small? It's Why is it on my bed? It's a baby. Sharon, that's what I'm are you Everyone kidding? You literally slept next to it the whole time. I, I didn't know it was there now that I'm conscious because I'll Tomorrow. I didn't walk today, but basically what we did was we went to snorkel with some sea turtles and we saw some really nice corals and quite a few fish. My god, obviously a little bit seasick, but it wasn't as intense as a whale watching one. But yeah, and we I got to touch the sea turtles and stuff like that, so it was pretty cool. Super tan. trying to do my essay as soon as possible. It's due tonight at 11.30 p.m. So that's there. Yeah, so that's what the plan for today is. And tomorrow's our last day here. So um, yeah, we're just trying to make the best out of 